Parkinson's disease affects half a million people in the U.S. It affected my uncle Herman. Also about 50,000 new cases are reported each year. There really is no cure for the disease, which gets worse over time. But Nine Healthline reporter Elizabeth Vowell shows you one treatment that sounds almost like science fiction. Central Community Theater is rehearsing for their production of Cinderella, a play associate director Karen Klinkingbird can relate to. I want to see lots of expressions. Except her fairy godmother came with a scalpel, and instead of glass slippers, she received a remote control. It's all, I'm trying to move it fast like I was before. Okay, now I'm going to turn it back on. Seven years ago, Karen was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease, a degenerative neurological disorder. I didn't know what was going to happen to me. Over time, she watched her fine motor skills fade away. It became difficult to move her fingers or even walk. Medication helped, but not consistently, and it caused side effects that made it hard to function day to day. It was embarrassing. As people would like say, what's wrong with you? When it became too much to bear, her neurologist suggested a procedure called deep brain stimulation, or DBS. It's a wire that's implanted into the brain while patients are awake, and it's hooked up under the skin to a little pacemaker-like device that I can control and program through the skin with a handheld computer. The wire is less than a millimeter wide and emits low electrical pulses that help the brain function more normally. As you can see in this video of a previous DBS procedure, patients are awake so that the wire can be tested and properly aligned on a spot in the brain about the size of a pea. This is with the device off. This is with the device on. We see the effect immediately and the patient sees it immediately at the same time. We've had some patients cry on the table because they recognize that their life is going to change for the better uh, instantaneously. Karen calls her DBS device a miracle. Since her procedure, she's been able to return to her busy life nearly symptom-free and reduce her medication. I don't feel like I have this horrible disease that's going to make me, you know, go down so far. For Healthline, Elizabeth Vowell, WAFB 9 News. Wow. Deep brain stimulation can be used throughout the patient's life to help relieve symptoms. It, it's also used to treat another disorder called central tremors and is covered by most insurance policies. Thank you.